good in the hood everybody and welcome to my youtube channel chatterbox where i talk about everything that happens around the crazy world and since i, I literally do so today i'm going to be trying to do something different today i'm going to be doing an album review on dua lipa's new album that was released yesterday called future nostalgia the future if you guys don't know this is the second studio album from dua lipa uh, who had her huge hit 2017 new rules and had another huge hit back in 2019 don't start now and now she's using 70s and 80s music to make this album and people are, are really excited for this album so i decided to give a review on it uh so so the album definitely lives up to it and the anticipate anticipation <laughs> uh hype it really it takes you into a time machine it takes you back to 70s and 80s music but yet has a modern twist to it and that's what really makes this album so good it's an album full of bops and party songs that even if, if you play it at a party it's so danceable and really gets you grooving so the album opens up with a, with a great boppy quirky song by the name of future nostalgia it's a great song and it's really it's like that that it gives you that empowering vibe you know if i were given a song to listen to every morning when i wake up and not get bored of it would be this song because you know it gets you ready for the day it gets you in a positive and happy mood it just really pump, it pumps you up and that's why i really like the song and then cool cool is definitely a cool song pun totally <laughs> Uh, and I really love its sharp beats, especially in the chorus. It really is, it gives you that sort of feeling if you're listening to it on your phones or headphones, you know. It's like sharp beats that just pushes it through in the song. It really feels so good. And I think it's a really nice song. Then we go on to Levitating. Levitating is like, definitely levitates me up with its futuristic and retro sound. And it's a, it's a good song otherwise and then we go on to pretty please after the heavy beats and heaviness from the song levitating we get into this chill quiet song with just some few beats that are added to it when the chorus gets bigger but yeah, i really like this song it also reminds me of like the you know justin timberlake's love sounds album released in 2006 you know those beats and stuff by timberland it sounds really good by the way and it's a really nice song so i kind of mess i'm not i'm not sick so much but these are all i have to say about the song because otherwise these songs are pretty amazing so i'm very quiet about it because i don't know how to describe them so anyways then we go to hell's need i have nothing to say about this song except it being super amazing astonishing shattering f fantastic and just plain 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 everything that relates to amazing amazing and amazing it's that good of a record or a song and i really enjoy it you know if you play it in loudspeakers it just gets you that hallucinating when you call my name you know it just you know, no matter what you are doing, you will dance to the song. It's that good. So I just really love it. it you know, hallucinates a listener. What's happening, it just hallucinates them and makes them dance. It's that fantastic. So then, Love Again is a great song, but I don't have anything otherwise to say about the song, except for it being great. great. Um, however, it is very high in my list in the ranking of songs in the app. So then, by the way guys, just to let you know that I'll not be ranking, I mean, I'm not ranking, I mean, I'll not be giving a review on our Dawn Start now, Physical, and uh, Break My Heart, because they are anyway singles, but I'll give a short review on them, they are all astounding songs, with uh, great music videos, and anyways, the, we move to Boys Be Boys. The message of the song is very emotional. And powerful it has a very strong meaning and again why she wanted to do a song like this and close off the album like that it was a smart thing to do however this one the instrumentals didn't appeal to me uh, that much maybe she used some better instrumentals the song would have been pushed 
totally fantastic. It would be really great. But, but, uh, but yeah, that's, that's that. Uh, the song, I would give it a tree because of its... But I think I would... I think it could have been better. It had a lot of potential in it. Anyways, now that we're done reviewing the track list, uh, in overall, the album is a thrilling, fun, and great experience of, mu uh, of music to the ears. It's really great. No matter what mood you are in, if you just listen to this album, you know, it makes you feel happy. It makes you forget what you're doing. Like I said before, it's just that great. And and sorry i don't know what to say else uh -huh. if you have both headphones i suggest listening to it on that because even though if i don't have one i've listened to one of them in the both stores and it sounds really good so i think that if you listen to this album so it would sound really good so i suggest so so uh and now let's move on to the ranking of the songs so i'm actually 11 boys will be boys three out of ten ten good in bed 3.5 out of 10 uh, and from this part of the list onwards I love all of these songs equally eh, but I love this other songs better than the others so if you think that the songs have been very low oh, from this list onwards I didn't like well sorry guys you're wrong well you're wrong don't think it that way I love all these songs I just love the other songs more than it so now you don't start now 6.5 out of 10 7 out of 10 it break my heart 7.5 out of 10 love again 8 out of 10 pretty please 8.5 out of 10 cool 9 out of 10 physical 9.5 out of 10 i used to make 10 out of 10 and future nostalgia 10 out of 10 so thank you guys for watching my video and if you really did enjoy it please give a like and subscribe to my channel uh, I'm not going to be doing a video on coronavirus. Instagram people are asking. Thank you for watching. Bye. Until next time. Yeah.